Hey guys, welcome to or back to my channel. Today I'm going to be trying out a video that I saw first on Elena Tabor's um, YouTube channel and then I saw something similar on Ellie Thoman's. So I thought I would try my own version of it. So what they did basically is try to recreate pictures of their moms. My mom and my sister helped me dig up some old pictures. My mom did some modeling. I want to say like in the 90s, so we're going to try to recreate some of those with the outfits, the makeup, and try for the location. We'll see how well that goes. I'm going to start by straightening my hair because my mom had like a little bob, which obviously I don't have, but I blew my hair out and I'm going to do a little bit of makeup and we're going to try for the first picture, so I'm excited. Okay, so obviously I'm not good at eye makeup, but... I tried to do it a little bit darker. There's a little bit of eyeliner on the outer corner. She had a dark red lip, um, took out my big earrings. She had a bob, so I'm trying to figure out like how, I don't know, I'll try to figure it out. I also have to put down these flyaways, but yeah, getting closer. <laughs> Mom, you can be in it, dude, come on. Okay, this is what the picture looks like. This is what we're going for. So we need to find a blank wall. I have the outfit. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that picture, we did get it, but it ended in a little bit of an argument because there are a lot of people telling each other what to do, but we're gonna try for another one today. The next picture is, she's wearing a white shirt, again, dark lip, and then um, jeans, so I'm gonna change into that and we're gonna try it. I think again, it's like a corner of a room, so we can just do that somewhere in my house. Got quite a lot to choose from. <laughs> Gotta steam the shirt first. You have to put in the 110% perfectionist. I feel like I look kind of crazy, but this is the next picture. So I feel like we, this one we could definitely do a pretty good job of. I'm hoping, I don't know. It's proven to be a lot harder to replicate the exact pose. Um, I also had to clip, wait, clip the back of this shirt so it looks a little bit more fitted like it is in this picture. Hey guys, we are back in my bathroom. It's been like two days, but I'm gonna try to recreate another one of the pictures. This one is not like a modeling picture per se, like it wasn't taken in a studio as a headshot. It's just a picture of her from the 90s, but I think the outfit is super fun and I think I have things that are similar to it. So again, I have to straighten my hair because I guess my mom blew out her hair a lot back then, I don't know. Now I'm going to try on the outfit. So this is the picture. I just think it's like a funny outfit. So the only denim jacket I could find is this one, which might be a little dark. I don't know if Nina has another one, I'll ask. I have, I think I have similar pants. They're not the exact same, obviously, but let's see um, what the best we can do is. This shirt is a little long for the picture and like it's about the length of the jacket in the picture. So I'm gonna try to fold it and then tape it. I don't want it to look like it's tucked in. That's not bad at all. Okay, that looks good actually. I'm impressed with my skills. I also have to fix this because it already got curly again. And also she did a dark lip again, which I'm not the biggest fan of because I don't like wearing lipstick, but I'll do it for the picture. You gotta do what you gotta do. Alright guys, so it's been a couple days since we took the pictures and then my mom was kind enough to edit them for me. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but she's a photographer now, so she's really good at all of the editing things. I guess I'm just going to go through and I can do side by side, side, by side with the picture, um, the original picture and the one that my mom took. And yeah, I guess I'll rate it like out of 10. I found it. So I'll put the first one original here and then our version. Yeah, so I'll start by saying what we did right. So we didn't have, obviously have the same exact clothes and also a problem that we noticed throughout all three of these is that my mom is like two inches shorter than me or one and a half, but like, so the angles were a little bit different when she was trying to take the pictures. And also the skirt that she's wearing in this one is a little bit shorter than the one that my sister gave me to borrow. But like the buttons on the side are right, the buttons down the middle of the top are right. So I feel like that was pretty good and it took us so long to try to get I mean, we didn't get the exact pose, but it took us so long to get something even close. The one thing I 
don't like is that my well obviously my hair is not the same length as hers was my smile is like a little weird i'm doing something weird with my lips but it was hard to get down her her model pose i don't know she's so good at it and the contrast is a little bit different but i think i did the pose pretty well like the hand and like the back arm and the way that she's posed i feel like i have the like line down right so i'm gonna give this one a like six out of ten i don't know that might be I don't know if that's too harsh or too generous. I feel like for me, I think we could have done a little bit better, but it was hard given the location and um, all of that, but yeah. All right, so the second one is this. So the first thing I tried to do was do to find like the corner that this is located in. I mean, it's not the same place, but I wanted to find a corner so we can get like the same kind of shot set up. So we tried doing that. It was actually in the same spot as the last one. Tried including some of the floor. So in this one, I just think I don't look like myself. I don't really like my face, but I think the editing um, is very accurate and also the outfit. It was pretty easy to accomplish, but um, I think it was on point. We just had to roll up the sleeves and we had the white button down. Um, her hair was also a little bit more like blown out and mine was just straightened. Um, and yeah, again, the like posing was a lot more difficult than I thought. So I think I'm gonna give this one, actually, I think this one is worse than the last one, but I don't wanna give it a five. So I'll, maybe I'll change the old one to a seven out of 10 and make this one a six out of 10, you know, so it's relative. But yeah, we tried our best. I don't know. It's a lot harder than you think. Like it's hard enough to get a good picture of yourself, but it's a lot harder to get a good picture that is the exact replica of another picture that you're trying to base it off of. So this was a challenge. This is what I signed up for. So this third one is not a model picture, but it's still like, I think it, the outfit was pretty funny. It's like early 2000s or 90s, I'm not really sure. I wasn't there, but um, I thought the like pants with the denim jacket was pretty funny. So I didn't have pants the exact same pattern as this, but I had a skirt with a very similar pattern. And I feel like because it's flowy, you can't really tell it is a skirt. So I'm kind of happy with that. And then the denim jacket, we also didn't have the same color, but it's like what we can do and the denim jacket, no, the white shirt would have gone further down than the denim jacket. So I had to tape it up and I think the pose was good and the location, I tried the best I could. And overall, I'm really happy with this one. Also, I edited it myself. So like, I was obviously like, she looks a little like orangey in the actual picture. So I tried to make that like same effect in the one that I edited. I changed the wall color cause it was actually gray on top. And oh, I edited out a logo on my shirt. So I'm like very proud of my amateur editing skills. But overall, I'm going to give this one an 8.5 out of 10 because it is my favorite. And I think I nailed the pose pretty well, even if we didn't have the exact same like clothing pieces and location. But yeah, that was basically the entire video. I had a lot of fun making it. I hope you had fun watching if you like these kinds of videos. I know my channel's like very random, but I'm just making what I would like to see and what is fun for me to edit and to make. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe or leave a comment or something. Yeah, I'd like to keep making videos, but obviously like been pretty, it's been pretty hectic. So I'm going to try my best, but thanks for watching guys. Bye.